The financial landscape in India is ablaze with action. Major players like Indian Railways, Dabba, Aurobindi Pharma, Container Corporation of India, Sun TV, 361 WAM, Unipads, and Indian Metals and Ferro Alloys are making waves with exciting announcements. And that's not all. Adding fuel to the fire, we've got breaking news from the global front. Is the Federal Reserve now a friend rather than a foe? The Sensex is soaring, leaping over 500 points as Powell's tone softens. But wait, there's more. Tata Motors is on a roll, with an upward revision and JLR EBIT outlook, making waves in the market, and strong performances are expected to continue, according to Prabhunas Lilidha. And speaking of big names, Apple is making record-breaking revenue strides in the incredibly exciting Indian market. Don't miss the latest currency update, where the Indian rupee strengthens against the US dollar, setting the stage for potential financial opportunities. And in the world of steel, Tata Steel's Q2 results indicate European operations continue to struggle, shaking up the industry. Plus. Stay tuned for upcoming earnings reports from Titan, Interglobe Aviation, and Zomato, as we delve into the latest earnings estimates. The financial world is buzzing, and you won't want to miss out on the latest developments. In a recent announcement, the Indian Railway Finance Corporation Limited has declared an interim dividend of 0.80 rupees. Shareholders are advised to take note of the record date which is scheduled for 10th November 2023. Dabber India Limited has also declared an interim dividend, which amounts to 2.75 rupees. The record date for this dividend is aligned with that of the Indian Railway Finance Corporation, set for 10th November 2023. Aurobindi Pharma Limited has indicated that the record date for their interim dividend will be declared on 9th November. This offers investors an exciting prospect, with the official record date falling on 20th November 2023. The Container Corporation of India Limited has declared an interim dividend of 3 rupees, with payments to be made on or after 23rd November. Shareholders should mark their calendars for the record date, which is set for 16th November 2023. Sun TV Network Limited is considering the declaration of payment for an interim dividend on 10th November. The 361 WAM Limited has made a noteworthy announcement by declaring their third interim dividend of 4 rupees which is expected to provide investors with an attractive dividend yield of more than 3%. Shareholders can anticipate payments on or before the 1st of December, with the record date set for 10th November 2023. This represents a promising opportunity for investors seeking a dividend yield that surpasses the 3% threshold in the current financial landscape. Stay informed as this development unfolds in the Indian financial market. Chumbal Fertilizers and Chemicals Limited is yet to declare the payment of their interim dividend. With this decision expected on 3rd November, the record date will be 15th November 2023. PDS Limited has declared an interim dividend of 1.60 rupees. Shareholders should be aware of the record date, which is scheduled for 15th November 2023. Surya Roshni Limited has declared an interim dividend of 2.50 rupees. Payments are set to occur on or after 21st November, with the record date coinciding with that of the Indian Railway Finance Corporation on 10th November 2023. Saxoft Limited has a record date for their interim dividend yet to be declared, but it will be considered on 7th November. The confirmed record date is 16th November 2023. Unipats India Limited is in the process of considering the declaration of their first interim dividend and fixing the record date on 9th November. Indian Metals and Ferro Alloys Limited has declared an interim dividend of 7.50 rupees. 
Shareholders should mark their calendars for the record date, which is scheduled for 10th November 2023. Vidhi Specialty Food Ingredients Limited is set to consider and declare their first interim dividend on 8th November. The official record date will be 17th November 2023. Amritanjan Healthcare Limited is also considering the declaration of their first interim dividend on 10th November. Anzan India Energy Yield Plus Trust has declared a total distribution of 2.45 rupees. Payments are scheduled for on or before 16th November, and the record date is 10th November 2023. Insecticides, India, Limited has declared an interim dividend of 3 rupees. Shareholders are advised to take note of the record date which is set for 10th November 2023. Asm Technologies Limited will recommend an interim dividend on 10th November. Bella Casa Fashion and Retail Limited is considering the payment of an interim dividend on 8th November. The record date for this dividend is set for 20th November 2023. Shradharai Technologies Limited will provide an interim dividend of 0.50 rupees. Shareholders are encouraged to be aware of the record date, which is scheduled for 17th November 2023. Lokesh Machines Limited is planning to consider the raising of funds by a rights issue on 10th November. A Shapuri Gold Ornament Limited is proposing to raise funds through a rights issue on 10th November. IFL Enterprises Limited has made the decision to withdraw the record date of 17th November for the purpose of a bonus issue only. These announcements bring significant opportunities and decisions for investors in the Indian financial market. Stay tuned for more updates as these events unfold. Thanks for watching. Please thumbs up if you like, subscribe, press the bell icon and never miss an update. Share and comment your thoughts on the comment section. And stay tuned with Corporate Actions India.